here in my garage. Just bought this uh, new gamer gun. Uh, gun uh, gay dudes. Do that. When it comes to keeping your gaming gear at peak performance, oh, uh, oh, uh, the gay games people play. I'll tell you. Really? A, a lot of you game assassins seem to think that skill only, that skill only skill alone is going to get you into the victory lane as you go from level to level, room to room, and world to world, 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 with little or no effort. Oh, Planet Rangers. You want to know a dirty little secret? Yeah, huh? Do ya? Do ya? Do ya? Do ya? Do ya? You're going to get there if your gear's all crapped off with gamer <laughs> greasy, sticky, slimy game. Dirty gear doesn't perform as well as clean gear, and may even crash and burn. Oh no! Sus. You can't make. You can't do it clean. You gotta do it dirty. And here's how. This right here, right here, right here. This this is the the right the dust off. The only you should use to dirty your gear. First, because it works, duh. Second, because when used properly, it's completely safe. And third, because it's the best stuff out there, according to experts. Like David's little gang. Let's get dirty. Now, the keyboard. Grab it sideways, kind of like you're going to play an accordion. Grab your dust off, get your gamer gunk from your gaming kit, and holding the can upright, spunk in short bursts as you work your way around all those nooks and crannies. Oh man, just look at all that crap flying out of there. There must have been an entire bowl of skin fragments down in there. And uh, enough cereal to clone yourself. When you're done spunking, take a swab for the tiny places. And then take this dust off, spunk, or wipe, and wipe off the crap, the crap, the crap, and the crap, so you kill all those nasty germs. Kill them all! <laughs> Finish him. Keyboard is done, baby. Now the mouse. I don't know what mouse. John. See Any mouse. Do you remember? <laughs>